What is up you guys? It's your boy Gold Miner and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we're going to be doing an unboxing for this new monitor that I just got from Amazon. This is going to be the monitor that I use for the PS5 if I do get the PS5. This is going to be a monitor that is really good for the PS5 because it has 144 hertz which can use the high frame rates that you will get on the PS5. Um, if you guys do decide to buy this monitor, please use my affiliate link down in the description to help support the channel. Also, there is another monitor that is supposedly better than this monitor, but it's cheaper. It's the AUK monitor, and it has a 1 millisecond response time, and this one only has 3 millisecond response time. If you do decide to get that one, I didn't get that one because... It comes in red, and this one comes in all black. I like the all black better. But if you do want to get the AUK, there also will be an affiliate link for that monitor down in the description. Alright? Um, so, let's get into the specs. We already know that it's 144 hertz. Well, and we also know that it's a free sync monitor, so it will be um, very good to use with my... Pre the console that I already have now that uses only 60 frames and then it's also curved and it has an edgeless design so I'm really excited to unbox this monitor I had to wait a couple days until my tripod came in so I could record this but it's finally here and I'm really excited to open up um, this new monitor this is my first time ever having a monitor I usually have TVs for my gaming but because I knew the PS5 was coming out and I wanted to use the high frame rates that's going to be available on the PS5, I decided to go with the TV is definitely bigger than it than the monitor because the TV is at, is literally as as bigger than the box. But we're not worried about size. We're just worrying about refresh rates and response time, which is this monitor is supposed to um, help with that. I'm not sure, but I do think this is a 1080p monitor, so you won't get 4K or 14 feet, 1440p or 2K on this monitor. We're not. This monitor is not for the um um H high HD quality. This is just for the high refresh rates and response time. All right. Um, I'm really excited. So let's get just get um into the unboxing. All right. Okay, guys, um, don't mind the sweat. Um, it's super hot in here, and because um, this room has super good lighting, I decided to record in here, but it's still super hot in here. So don't mind the sweat. Just bear with me. All right, so let's get into the unboxing. All right, so... Let's see... I will be giving you guys a review on this monitor in like about a week after I've been using it because I don't want to I don't want to buy the monitor and it's not a good monitor and then let you and not tell you guys that okay so I will be giving a review shortly after like about a week um after I get the monitor no after I keep after using the monitor all right I'm super, like, guys, you don't understand how excited I am, bro. Like, I've really been waiting a couple, of, a long time to, uh, to get, to get this monitor. Well, I, I got it already, but I couldn't record because, uh, my tripod didn't come in. And I wouldn't open the box unless I had my tripod so we could, you know, have an amazing video recording experience wow it's super hot in here i'm really sweating bullets but i really i want you guys to really see this video very quick clearly and because of that i'm willing 
to die in this hot room. Whoa. Hope that wasn't anything important. Where is how wait is the monitor inside of this thing? Uh look at this thing fell. I'm gonna try to open it from here. All right. Okay, guys. This is, let me put it back in. This is how it looks outside of the box. Let's take it out. And we don't want to break it. I'll tell you this, guys. For sure, the difference, the size difference between my monitor and my TV is definitely bigger. Yeah, so this is the the stand this is so, all the stuff that it comes with and there goes the battery or the powers thing all right so i'm gonna try to pull up let's let's look at the monitor first all right and wrap it get the monitor let's unwrap it Are you guys ready for this? Hold up, let me. Are you guys ready for this? Whoo, whoo, I don't even, bro. The plastic looks so good that I don't even want to un, un, um, un, take it off. It looks so clean, right? Look at that. Look at that. That looks clean. I'm getting a little bit of dust from that white thing, but it looks clean though. All right, let's get that. Let's, let's see. Hold up. And it's very small. Very thin and small. Okay. Let's get to putting this thing together. All right. Uh, let's see. So this is the stand. All right. Uh, go the screws and stuff. This is the pack flip. You guys want to see that? This is what the pack flip look like. Okay. Yeah, I see it. It comes with a HDMI. Um, is this an HDMI? I think it's an HDMI. Let's open it up. Yeah, I think this is an HDMI, but it's shaped weirdly. Uh, it's shaped weird. I don't know why it looks like that, but let me show you guys. It comes with an HDMI, but it's not shaped the same. If you can see, like, yeah, it's shaped differently. So I don't know. I hope it can fit my HDMI cord because this is the one I use. I don't know what this is. Maybe that's for a PC or something. Uh, it doesn't say anything on the, on the thing. So I don't know. All right. So let's get into screwing this. Oh, it comes with a little top thing. That's look. That's nice. I like how this screw, screw looks. It's pretty. Oh, and it even says Septra. Tetra monitor. That's cool. All right. So there goes a part of the stand. Hopefully nothing falls off. Okay. Okay, here's the screws. All right. Okay, guys, I just read the manual and I think I know how to do this. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you have all the parts that you need. Um, because if you don't, this is going to be a big problem. So you're going to need these 
is going to say base screws and um, neck screws. I don't know if you guys can read them, but you're going to need these neck screws and these base screws. And there's a little sticky thing at the bottom that you're going to need too, if you guys can see that. All right. Going to need this, that, and a screwdriver, of course. I'm not sure what this is for. Did not see this in the manual, but okay, let's get into it. So the first thing you do is you put this like this, and then you take the um, you take the base screws, which is right here, all right? We're gonna drop that right there. Take one. We're just gonna screw this in really quickly. All right, take the other base screw, you screw that in, all right? Guys, make sure you screw, see, see? Drop it in there, and then you screw it in. Drop it in there, and screw it in. All right, after you screw in the as after you screw in the, the um, base screws, you take this and you take, you see, you see this? You take the white, then you take the white thing off. It's supposed to be off the sticky side and then you just go in and you stick this at the bottom, right? Boom, right? So like that, okay? Boom, now we already halfway done. All right guys, so this is gonna, you're gonna wanna take, let's take this out, right? And then you're gonna wanna take this, you're gonna wanna take this and put it in there like that, all right? And then you're gonna use the next screws to screw in these two holes, okay? These two holes. I'm gonna take the next screw, right? Hope you guys can see that. Make sure it's like that. See? <clears throat> but yeah, it didn't stay because I didn't screw it in at all. Okay, so let me put it back in. Okay, it is, it's supposed to slide right in there. Right under these two parts, it's supposed to slide right in there. Now I'm gonna screw it. Okay, let's screw the next one. Luckily, luckily this, this screw is magnetic, so use that to your advantage. Put the you put the plastic pieces right back. All right. Put these. See, you put these plastic pieces back. Make sure to show you guys. Right. We we'll put them right back in there. But I'm gonna push it. I'm gonna put it back down. Okay, put that back in there. Boom. Now we're done. I'm probably gonna need to wipe this down, but so I see there's these extra pieces. I don't know what they're for. Let me know in the comments if you know what they're for. Maybe it's for mounting them 
mounting it. I don't know if you want to mount the monitor. Okay, are you guys ready? This is the main reason why I did not want to peel it before I before I uh, before I finished fixing it because I know I was gonna be touching it a lot and I did not want to peel it before I touch it. But even though it got a bunch of fingerprints on there, it looks really good. Do you guys agree with me? Or do you guys, what do you guys think? It looks amazing. I guess you guys are ready for this. Uh, I'm gonna be peeling the monitor. Look at that. You guys ready? Are you guys ready for this? Gonna peel the monitor. Yeah, baby. Hmm. Nasty, bro. Nasty. Nasty, bro. Look at that. Look at that. Whoo. Whoo. Bro, look at that. It looks so clean, guys. Oh, my God. Looks really good. Even though it's small. It's still, it's, look, I'm really excited. You know, so even though it's small, bigger than I expected, it really looks good. So, give me a second. Uh, I need to plug it up. Right? This is, how, this is the charging thing. Well, not charger, but the power thing. Whoo! Bro! Oh, my God. When it turns on, this little light in the back turns on. That's really cool. Look at that. Did you guys see that? Wow, that's amazing. Okay. I'm going to go I'm going to go get my PC and connect it. Okay, guys. I'm going to connect it to my PS4. Uh, my PC is about to die, so Then I know I got some fingerprints on there. Um, I just wanted to show you guys it has um, 1.4 uh, HDMI and 2.0 HDMI. So you can use this one uses the 144 hertz, and this one uses up to 120 hertz. It has a display port. Oh, that's what that was—a display port. Okay, and it also has a microphone jack. All right. So I'm going to be connecting my uh my HDMI to the, I'm gonna just con connect it to the HDMI one because my my monitor can only do, my PS4 can only do 60 Hertz. So it's no point in um, putting it at 144. So, all right. So I just connected it to my PS4. Now, let's see, I hope I don't, I didn't get any fingerprints on there. Okay, I just turned on my PS4. Whew, I really like the way the colors are looking already. I'm really excited to see what it has. Uh, yeah, it's just, I'm really, to be honest, I, I'm really super excited, man. I, I'm, I'm really satisfied with the um, monitor so far. It really looks good. Whew, I hope you guys can see what I see. Okay. Oh, about this. Oh, <laughs> oh, I got scared. Whoa, easy kill, easy kill, bro. All right, <laughs> first kill on my new monitor, bro. <laughs> I just deep that kid. 
Hey, but I'm still lagging, guys. That's why I'm not gonna stream. So, um, yeah. So, wait. So, I have something I'm gonna do to fix my lag. So just wait on it. All right. All right. Easy. Easy kills, man. Easy kills. Easy class, man. <laughs> I know they're bots, man. Don't don't call me in the comments like I'm trash. <sighs> Sorry, guys. My mom came in the room and then uh, that's why I got killed. All right, GG's though. All right, guys. So far, I really do like the monitor. It looks really good. Um, the colors look really good. It's, it look it just everything about it just looks nice and um I'll have to um use it for a while to see if it's if performance wise is any good but so far I really do like it and I would recommend it um so guys again please use my affiliate link down in the description if you do want to um buy this monitor or the other monitors there are going to be, I'm going to put other monitors like this in the description if you guys want to look at some other ones. But please use my, but please use my affiliate link if you guys want to get a monitor because it really will help my channel out and if you guys want to support me. Alright, so that's pretty much it. I do plan on doing more videos like this because I do plan on upgrading my gaming setup. Let me know what you guys want to see. Um next um and that's pretty much it hope you guys like the video please leave a like comment on um, what you think do you like this monitor what monitor do you would you buy um are you getting the ps5 and if you are are you gonna get a monitor like this just let me know what you guys think down in the comments and make sure you like and if you're new subscribe bye